welcome to my channel or welcome back if you've been here before so I just kind of wanted to give a rundown about my first week it was all over the place um, a lot of paperwork a lot of money being spent it was just a lot going on so um, basically I got here on like a Thursday I believe yeah, I got here on a Thursday. So I got here on a Thursday and my uh, supervisor and one other jet that was currently here came um, to pick me up and they met me at the station in Fukushima and we went to eat and then we went to the Board of Education where I started to fill out a mountain of paperwork. I stayed at the Board of Education for the rest of the week and then the next following week just filling out paperwork um, some advice that I would give is if you know how to spell your name in katakana memorize that because you're going to spell your name like five million times also um, if you are aware of what your address is I would memorize it or take a picture of it and like make sure to do that um, because you're going to be doing that a lot as well. Um, other than that, the only thing that you're definitely going to need is a Japanese phone number. If you have a Japanese phone number and you've memorized it, definitely keep that. But take a picture of it if you don't memorize it. I didn't memorize anything in the first week. I was referencing a picture for like at least 75% of my paperwork. Before the video begins, um, I just want to come in here and say that like every situation is different. Of course, this is a jet program. Just because it happened to me doesn't mean it's going to happen to you. Um, so I was able to get my fire insurance set up, my car insurance set up, um, my uh, medical stuff set up and ready to go. I also uh, got my car in the same first week um, and my banking information so your banking information is going to be done by your board of education if your supervisor is as kind and wonderful as mine is they will go with you and they'll translate and help you figure all that out um, it really was easy they choose the bank for you so well they chose the bank for me so hopefully that is the case for you. If not, I, I reference other videos because uh, every situation is different. You're going to get really tired of hearing me say that, but it is real. Your banking may be handled by your um, supervisor. They will set all that up for you. Typically, you just get a regular Japanese bank account. Um, the bank account is literally just so a bank account to hold your money. You don't do... You can't do like online purchases and stuff like you can in America or other cultures or other countries. It's literally just to hold the money. <laughs> that's it. Um, a few weeks after that, you may get a bank card. That's going to allow you to take money out of the ATM. You also have a bank book that comes with that, but that's going to, you're going to get all that stuff at the same time. So another thing that's going to happen this week or the first week is you're going to have a Honko stamp, which looks like this. It comes in this little compartment thing and it, when you open it up, it has a stamp in here that has your special signature on it and then a little thing for the ink. Um, personally, the ink is worthless. I will definitely be getting my own ink pad. Um, but your Honko stamp is your life. This is your life. Like, this is your signature for everything. People don't sign things here in Japan. They Honko. Um, also, you'll need it, depending on what your school does, you're going to need it for, um, attendance, making sure that you're here every day for school. Uh, so that's also what happened in the first week. Um, um, yeah, so the first week was pretty chill. It was a lot of experiences, a lot of getting to know people, a lot of like adventure in the first week for me. I didn't teach immediately. I only started teaching after Golden Week. So that's just how my supervisor and my board of education set it up. It may not be the same. So... Um, with further ado, let me just go ahead and let you guys see all the stuff I did. So, yeah.
over there and Evie had one earlier I don't I'm sorry did you want to be on camera Does it, okay <laughs> okay I just bite into it yeah mmm it's good it's sweet Okay, I'm back. Alright, so if you guys like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. I hope that I was able to give you guys at least a little bit of information. Also, a little bit of like adventure also. Um, I would appreciate if you went ahead and commented what you are looking forward to do when you get to Japan. Um, cause we can do them together until you get here. <laughs> um, and also I would not mind if you subscribe and join the family cause we're building a family over here. I uh, will see you guys in another video. Bye. All right, so this lighting is horrible. I have to get a ring light, but like the amount of stuff that I've bought off Amazon is like unhealthy. So we're gonna have to just make it work. Cause look at the shadow. Oh my God, I look tired. I'm not tired either. I do have to edit this video though, so.